difficult, a top 8 match. And then I lost in top 4, but that was okay, because I already had my pass. This is new. Hey, look at that, it's not a plat card. Does that mean that I can get... Oh, intrigue cards if I just pull from the pack now? Okay, I might have to, to try that. Hmm... Mm. Don't we have another three days? I have no idea about like intrigue card, animated but not plat, no funny border from uh, from being a Kickstarter backer, I suppose. Is this border from being a, a Patreon or so? Because yeah, this border wasn't in the game. Um, when I played, and I do remember seeing something about this border. Uh, my first thought on seeing this border was like, ah, it doesn't look as cool as Plats or Infinity Border cards, so I don't particularly care about it. Mm. No, I shouldn't do that. No, I am just gonna go for that. Okay. Uh huh. Thunder Apprentice is. Um, Difficult to actually make use of. Mm. Let's see how this goes. I am at 7, so any more will make me start discarding. Next turn I'll probably play something from my hand. Oh, look at that! Oh, okay, 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 understandable. Ouch. Um... Blood Arrow. And let's see how that goes. My, I'm still at 7, right? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yep. But then that creates a card in my hand and I discard. Okay, so I guess I'll just play this. It's a good thing that I drew Confront the Aether for, uh, for that. So I'm going to try to open some packs to see if I... Um, if I can pull some Intrigue cards. Alright, if character in the Assault Zone gains Unstoppable and Consume 2. Good call. Did that, was that for spawn? I think it was for spawn. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm, Thunder Apprentice is difficult to use, but, but it is powerful. Like, it's just man, mind games. Um... The more um, affected by mind games your opponent is, the more powerful Thunder Apprentice is. Another spawn. I think that the previous spawn buffed this one. Okay. It's a good thing that I have another Blood Arrow. Yeah, I have priority, so I don't have to worry about any nasty buffs or so. Is Jim playing cards that aren't out yet? Um, this one, I... Uh, I don't know, like, that's why I said, like, I'm just gonna try to open the pack to see um, if I can get cards like that. I'm gonna open a couple. After all, I do have some resources from back in the old Infinity Wars days. Mm, I haven't gotten a lot of uh, gold, I've noticed. Mm, but it's fine. Coil Primal Hunter. Selecting back. Nice try. Perhaps I shouldn't do this, but let's try to get rid of the Primal Hunter.
And in case you were referring to the Popper tournament, uh, I played uh, Cascade. John, or no, not uh, I played Gruul Cascade. Mm, it didn't go very well. I, I was not really as prepared as I would have liked to be for the purposes of that tournament. Um, I could have done better if I had been a bit more prepared to to play. Mm. It was still fun. Uh, it has been a very a very long time since I had uh, played um, physical magic since before COVID, pretty much. Mm. Okay, I was not expecting this to be deployed this turn, but it's fine. I've never been that much of a fan of this card. I feel like the overcharge is kind of lame. It's a 14-14-4-4 and discarding a, one card that good. Uh, I am inclined to think that it is not the case. Mm. Hmm... To have something that big that early, I see. Yeah, I, I guess I agree. Um, like, uh, it is a very big thing, but... But yeah, it is pricey. Mm, I could also use Confront either in this, instead of making a Rita token here. I think that's the correct thing to go for. Let's see. You know why I say that it, it doesn't seem that worth it to me? Because, um... Ouch. Um, because I'm used to playing Genesis, and Genesis does that very frequently. It's great for mod mid rangey warpath builds that aren't just trying to hyper-ramp. Mm. I guess so. I think I, I think I agree. I still don't like it that much. What if I don't do that? What if instead of that I do this? That's probably the better play. And these two. You never played in the deck, to be fair, only as commander. Oh yeah, like, that in the deck does seem pretty awful, because it doesn't even... If it said it gains plus 5, plus 5, and haste, then it would be way, way more usable. Um, but yeah, I think it's only playable in command zone. But it's not, it's not a bad thing. There's a fair amount of cards that are only really playable in command zone. Um... I think that Thunder Apprentice is only really playable in Command Zone. I wouldn't really want to play it in non-Command Zone. Um, ooh, Dragon. Okay. Oh, Dragon. Okay, okay. That's fine. Should I go into the Mazdas to try to hit another Dragon for Fonzies? Also, my opponent got Hell's Gambler into Hell's Gambler. Hopefully, Hell's Gambler doesn't get a dragon. Or maybe, hopefully, it does get a dragon, so I can do this. Mm, the 360 no scope. Okay. I wonder if this is not... Okay, it was not too much of a... Of a... Um, Telegraph, uh, telegraph moved to pull back to the back row for the purposes of mass death. Uh, Jim pays nine. Okay, calamity or dragon stuff is gonna start happening. Mm, I could play secrets of Baroria for the purposes of not dying to a dragon. Um, 
Or I could reanimate that dragon with Dark Wish. I barely use that mode. Um, but I think it is the correct thing to do this time. And I have 5, I could draw cards. Because burning uh, my opponent for 12 is not really going to do a lot. I could do this in Secrets of Baroria. Um, do I die from 43? Do I go below 15 from from 43 is the correct question, actually. Uh, I don't. I don't. So I think I can, I can wait for one more turn. I don't really see myself dying here. Uh, if I don't do that, mm. hopefully I go. I don't go below 30. Let's see what happens. Oh, there was no dragon. Sweet. I think that I'm gonna start using these secrets of Baroria. Mm, does that deck has has anything that can destroy the dragon that I could dodge with Word of Command? Probably not. I'm just going to put the dragon here. Secrets of Baroria, recycle the Dark Wish. Dark Blast. Oh, I mean it's looking like I'm going to have to to burn my opponent to death. Um Oh, the disappointment. Oh, the pain. Oh, okay. Uh, I wonder if Jin drew into that. Uh, because I think the plan was indeed to eventually Calamity. Um, but I think that when Jin paid 9, there was no Calamity. Okay, so now is uh, this is where I die, right? I think this is where I die. Mm, I wouldn't be surprised if there was a dragon coming for me this turn. Jing with 12 resources. I'm, ju I'm just gonna play 9, or pay 9, and we shall see what happens. I'm not such a fan of these cards, but... Um, it's okay, like, it does fulfill the role of being uh, an ability that... Um, Helps me get closer to Oblivion, and it also prevents me from dying. I just wish that it didn't require me to pay 9. It's kind of rough. Um, having a dragon in the grave to reanimate would be nice, but it went away. Or having Oblivion, that would also be nice. How's Oblivion looking? Mm. 9, okay, so I can not get it already. I could also acquire a dragon. I'm gonna acquire Oblivion, however. Mm, I could also get the Dragon, actually, with the second Dark Wish. Instead of uh, burning my opponent. Or I could get the Siphoner for Funny Siphoner plays. Funny Siphoner plays could deal more damage than the Dragon. Yeah. I used to play more Siphoners, but now I only play one. Alrighty, let's see how this goes. Siphoner, Word of Command, Assault Zone. Dark Blast. Ah, but I have priority. I have priority. Hold on. If I have priority, doing that is not a good idea. I'd rather go for Oblivion instead. Oblivion is gonna save me from uh, whatever dragon uh, Jin decides to go for. Mm, because I am almost entirely convinced that there's gonna be dragons coming my way. Or call the warpath, perhaps? Is Jin going for call the warpath? Because if so, that's uh, that could be bad. Yes, if so, that could be bad. Especially considering how I have priority here. I think that I should just go for the siphoner play. I hope that I don't die here. Hmm. 
that's not gonna deal that much damage, but it is gonna be pretty decent damage regardless. Drop bear with enrage. Uh, it's fine. Okay. Okay, this is getting exciting. I think it's maybe Oblivion time. Uh, now that I don't have priority, I just I just wonder why um, why they're ramping. Oh, another Oblivion is so uh, about uh, as good as it could have been, like uh, the best possible draw. Mm, I think that Jin is also playing around the morale because. Oh, yeah, I've been going hard on the morale burn. Yeah, these Grave Robes are not really that bad uh, to play in Oblivion dot deck, since after all they are an ability. That's fine. Hmm. I feel like I'm gonna die. <laughs> I feel like no matter what I do, it's so very difficult for me to win this this game. I don't think I've ever won against Jin, even in old Infinity Wars. Uh, I should just go for it. Having uh, one of these right now would be pretty good. Yes, it would get me the win having one of those. Uh, unfortunately, I do not possess such a thing. Second Oblivion is good to hear. Second Oblivion? I'm not gonna... Or I guess I could since it's not gonna kill this guy. And it does guarantee that I am not gonna... Well, it doesn't really guarantee it. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go for Secrets of Beroria. Um, in case there's some, like, hasty garbage. And then on my turn, when I, or on the next turn when I don't have priority, I'm gonna use Oblivion. Um, that sounds like it's probably the correct thing to do. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, that's great. Oh boy, that that was good. Create a mountain giant. It's a, a spirit in addition to its other types. Recall four. Where's recall? Does it say that like you may cast that for its recall cost for from your graveyard and remove it from the game? Mountain giant. So why does that why does that cost four? It seems. Crazy under cost, uh, like a 14 14 for 4, and then you can just play another 14 15 for 4. Hmm. Anyway, that was a pretty great secret of Baroria. Uh, what I did was absolutely the right play. Now I can. Oblivion Pain 9? Oblivion Pain 9 doesn't seem like a good play to me. My opponent has priority, so I cannot get rid of these. I'm gonna wait until next turn to use this Grave Wrath. Try to get rid of that. Mm. Gonna try to shuffle one of these in to see if I can draw it. I have 18 cards in my deck. Mm. You never know. Do I do that? I mean, it's not that great. Um, my only hope to ever get another Secrets of Baroria is to use it at full resources, and that would just kill me. I think that this is the correct thing to go for. Let's see how that goes. Another dragon. Okay, second Oblivion. Okay, so I won by HP and I won by morale. Let's go. Oh, that was difficult. That was so hard. Um, but I just managed to make the correct play multiple times in a row. That was great.